29, Franco Curry. 14, Curly Witch. Tonight's going to be a jam-packed night of entertainment. So we have two games, actually. The first game is our local team playing against each other, and we have newer girls playing for the first time. So it's a huge opportunity and moment for them to be able to showcase their talent in front of their city and their family and friends. The second game is actually a co-ed game, and it's going to be faster pace. And we have someone from the Men's uh, National Canada Derby team that are, is here training us right now, and he'll be playing with us as well, which we're very, very excited for. Just do it. <laughs> um, really go with your gut instinct. Sometimes your mind can play games with you and thinking you can't do it. We have people from all parts of different life experience. So some people have sports experience, some people don't. Uh, some people are athletes. Um, Honestly, you'll meet really interesting people and people that you would never, you know, meet otherwise from Derby. There's, I think, a few components. The first one is a challenge. It is a challenge. A lot of people think because it's a sports game, it's a body challenge, but it's also a mental challenge because it is game, it's strategy. It's not like the game before with Skinny Minnie Miller where, you know, you're clotheslining people, you're taking people out really roughly. It really comes down to now being the mental game and strategy. How can I score more points? And the second part is the family. You really develop a family and that's where people love coming together. We have girls coming in to play with us tonight from Timmins, Cochrane, Kirkland, um, down south, Sudbury. So you really are able to see people that you haven't seen in a while and play against them. After the game's done, we're all friends again. So during the game time, it's game, but afterwards you'll all go get a beer together, have fun, um, and really just enjoy each other's time. So I was part of the original uh, group that uh, started the league in November, or sorry, uh, fall 2017. Um, so I've been playing on and off. Uh, I actually broke a wrist for a while I was out uh, because of Derby. So uh, I've been in and out for the past year and a half. Um, and uh, it was really something that I wanted to participate once I heard it, that it was a league starting in, in West Nipissing and North Bay. I really wanted to join and and be part of this uh, experience. It just looked awesome, to be honest. I had a cousin who uh, did it in London, UK. Uh, she was part of a roller derby th uh, team, and the first time I saw that, I thought it was just amazing um, how this is such a, uh, an empowering sport for women. Um, I've never been into sports in my life. Uh, it was really the first time that I'm part of a, of a team, of a group, and uh, just meeting all these women, it was really something that was out of the, the box for me, out of the ordinary. Um, um, and I never regretted it. I'm still here, uh, and I'm uh, I'm still as hooked on Derby as I was from the first day. Our Facebook page is a perfect opportunity to uh, reach out to us. So we're looking for women to join our team. We're looking for juniors and men, and we're also looking for reps. So if you don't want to get into the action with getting hit or hitting other people, we're looking for referees. We will train you every step of the way. You don't need equipment for your first time coming out. We will give you free loaner equipment to try out, and we will train you every step of the way. There's actually a 12-week course that we go through and really teaching the skills of how to get hit, how to receive the hit, how to give a hit properly and so that you're being really safe when you are on that track and you have to pass actually a test before you're allowed going on the track. So we're not throwing anybody out there, we're making sure that you're ready both um, physically and mentally um, and that you're ready to go on there.